a new train modeling addiction has taken root in my head. I will explain in more detail in a future video. But today, I take my first steps in a bigger journey by building this mini diorama kit by Kato. From what I was told, it has everything you need to complete the kit. So let's see how close I can get this thing to the picture on the box. Let's get to the unboxing. Inside the box, we have the Diorama Kun book. I'll check that out later. The base, foliage, paint, glue, rail, instructions, and a few other things. Unboxing done, let's clear my desk and get to building this thing. First, the base. If you're enjoying the video so far, please hit like. It really helps the video out and subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this. Looking at the instructions, it seemed easy enough to follow, though everything is in Japanese. My years of building Gundam figures are finally coming in handy. Or was it? I made so many mistakes and became so frustrated building this thing, but I learned so much. I have never worked with a kit with so many tiny pieces and I damn near gave up when it came to cutting out these things and the trees, the damn trees. I learned the meaning of patience with those things. Even with all the mistakes and the poorly followed instructions, it started to come together little by little and my motivation returned once it started to take form. Painting stuff, working with the putty-like thingy and applying the grass were easily my favorite parts. In the home stretch, I finally finished the papercraft train which will be a placeholder until I can get a better one. I then added the additional bits and pieces and voila! The diorama was complete. It took 5 freaking hours. But I honestly would do it again. Maybe I might but with actual model trains next time. I'll explain what this practice mini diorama is leading up to in a future video. Please rate my completed diorama in a comment below and feel free to give me tips and pointers. Thank you for watching.